Hello. Well, today uh, I've bought myself uh, a new mic just here. So I'm not sure if it's working. Uh, I tried it earlier and it seemed to be. And there's a new angle. So I've managed to move the, the bracket for my phone uh, over to the side of the windscreen. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start the engine up and see if uh, you can still hear me and get used to looking at the little dot on the camera just here. Well, hey, just there. There we go. Hello, there we go. Yep. So let's start the engine up and see what happens. Just to wait for the. That's it. Hopefully you should still be able to hear me because as you've seen in my previous videos uh, I had the, the camera stuck on top of the dashboard using the, the microphone on the camera so we'll see if it works. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a couple of runs in our driveway and um, I'll do one run with uh, you looking at my ugly mug and then uh, another run with uh, that My wife just coming up the driveway with a lawnmower, so I have to wait for her to come by. So that traffic jam's gone, sorry. Uh, my wife is gone. Uh, so we'll leave it go. There we go. going backwards now without me crashing into anything without crashing into the lawnmower at least the reverse on this van is quite uh, sensitive if you let's keep an eye on the mirror it's going to crash into our car Oops, I crash into the dustbins either. Right, okay, so we're back in, in into my parking place. Now I'm going to do a little video of uh, looking forwards. Um, okay, here we go. Right, well, we've got the, the camera pointing forwards. I'm beginning to wonder whether the actual view is a bit low. Uh, we'll see. Anyway. So we've got a neutral problem with it again. No, it doesn't want to go into neutral. It's in drive. No. My wife is trying to get back in, into the van. It is a bit low, isn't it? Well, I'll have to alter that, I think. When I go backwards. Right, oh, yeah, let's try again. I think that's a bit further up. I'm going to go backwards now anyway. Trying to run over anyone. Oh, that's actually mowing the lawn at the moment. Usually I do it, but she decides to do it today. But we uh, tend to lend the, the mower to my father-in-law who lives in front of our place. And so she's had to go and get the lawnmower so she's at our place. It'd be nice if we had our own lawnmower, but uh, that's it, that's how it goes. Whoops. Alright, well that seems okay. Go forward one more time. I'll try to get neutral, but it's not working. For some reason, neutral feels. Sorry, it feels like neutral uh, works when it feels like it, and it's stuck in drive at the moment. Anyway, let's go. Now, now it's in neutral. 
Why has it done that? That is in drive now. One of these days I'm going to hit these gates. Both of the brakes are okay. There we go. Felt quite good for a vehicle like this. Right, one last reverse and that's it for today, I think. And then I'll play everything back on the computer and see if the mic's actually worked. I'm going slowly backwards because my wife's got the Renault Sync sticking its bottom out and I just miss it by a few centimetres. Oh, that's not very level. I always like to park with the back end, the corner of the back end, left with the edge of the garage door. There we go, that's good. No do. Alright, well, thanks for watching this little test and uh, hopefully it will work, which means that um, whenever I do a video in the future, you will be able to hear me. And funnily enough, it's back in neutral again. It's really odd. I can't quite understand that. It must be a problem with the electronics. That said, the, the alarm for the um, uh, the alarm for the headlights, that's it. The alarm for the headlights doesn't uh, seem to work anymore. Because if you leave the headlights on when you open the door, the driver's door, then you get an alarm, but it stopped working. So probably there's some electrical gremlin somewhere in the van. Anyway, thanks for watching and feel free to subscribe if you want to and I'll see you again. Bye bye.